Again, you always interfere. Those stupid goblins were all talk. You are a king, are you not? Why would you choose to make your citizens suffer? Those coins are mine to spend as I please. Very well. Let me tell you a story. Long ago, there was once a benevolent king with extraordinary powers. In order to keep his people happy, he put his power into the money, so all shared it. But what happened to him? Instead of thriving, the country was destroyed by a traitor. And instead of being mourned, I was called a mad tyrant who cursed my own country. Didn't you use the cauldron against your own land? It matters not now. Both the king's power and virtuous spirit have been infused into the coins. Once these coins were melted in the lava, my power would have returned to me. Those idiotic goblins! No, I shall let this go. I am a forgiving person. I still have hope. There is just one egg. Don't underestimate it. As the prophecies state, this is the egg of the dragon that dooms us all. In the Valentine prophecies, they call this snake, uh, Dragon, Leventhen. A dragon's egg? So Wagner was referring to you when he said that. My fury will burn the world! I will give you all my power! I entrust it all to your fiendish, brutal nature. Now hatch, Leventhen! Show us your strength!
them withering away while I was there. Who are you? I am Prince Cornelius of Titania. I see. Edmund's boy. I didn't understand why you carried the mystic sword of Titania. But now, I see why he gave you that patricidal blade. Patricide? I don't think he'd tell you. He killed his own father, King Gallen, and took the crown. My father couldn't do that! My grandfather was killed when the country was attacked by the demon beast. But my father was visibly frightened when he saw this sword in my hands. Huh? That voice that gave me the sword. It knew who I am. No, it can't be. That cannot be my grandfather. King Gallen must have wept in his cell. In addition to killing his own citizens, <laughs> he was slain by his own son. I had thought that after the attack, my father was the kingdom's savior and was given the crown. You say my grandfather was the demon beast? That's absurd! He transformed via a mystic power passed down through the Titanian royal family. In order to fight my own intimidating army, Gallen made a decision. 
Our military forces were crushed under his feet, and we were scattered. There was no time for anger. The beast continued to rampage through the kingdom for seven days. So my father destroyed the beast in order to save the country. Be grateful for Edmund. If he did not claim to know the mystic power himself, I would have invaded Titania. Your land would have been easy to conquer. So that's why he was stubborn. This rumble is an omen. This is not good. If Onyx, the Inferno King, were to greet us, it would not be a good thing. Wait! Where are you going? Into the flames of purgatory. I bid thee farewell, until the world dies. <sighs> It's all here. I see. I'm relieved. Cornelius, thank you for everything. I speak on everyone's behalf. I would have been worried if I lost the coins as well. You say you're from Titania? You shouldn't go home for a while. Uh, not with the way the town by the castle is. What? Haven't you heard? A dragon has appeared in the castle town. A dragon? A woman has been chosen to be sacrificed to it. The king of Titania is unable to do anything, and the country is in a panic. My father is ruthless. All right. In the last session, did we? Yeah, we maxed this out, so now should be. Putting our buffs into the passive skills. This one. The rest of these will I'm getting the the next and last chapter for uh Cornelius.
Let's see. Actually, I'm not sure what else to pick from these ones. I'll just finish this side off then. should flee the country. The government is about to collapse. The king is now sacrificing innocent civilians to the dragon in the sewers. Even noblemen and political dissidents are being fed to that thing. Filthy piss! I can't get my research done with all these puka and goblins! These back streets seem more dangerous with all these suspicious looking sorcerers. You can use my magic to head back to the Puka village, okay? I can't work in this scary town any longer. I'm closing up my shop, so I'll give you a discount. It's been a while. I see you've come back safely from Horn Mountain. I ran out of medicine. It was a nightmare. By the way, I saw a man who looked like the king in an alley up ahead. Nah, it was probably just my imagination. All right. Let's go here. Get some whatever level ups we can. Welcome. What can I get you today? With pleasure. Will this be all for you? Father and Urza. Please forgive me, Urza. I have done as you asked. Repent for the sacrificed. You were too stubborn to hand over the Book of Transformation. I had no choice but to call my dragon servant. Please return the book. I can't let it happen again. King Galen's suffering was nothing compared to this! Stop. Please. The blood won't go away. Blood from my poor father. Then be relieved. Your pain will soon end. I shall call King Galen back to this land from the netherworld. And then what? You will make him king? As the prophecies state, he will be the great force that causes the world's end. He shall call himself the Beast of Armageddon, and he will rule the world. And with the Ring of Titrell as well, our wishes will come true. Urza. 
So you were behind this? Well, well, Prince Cornelius. I was surprised to see you returned from the Netherworld, but to see you survive an encounter with the great Wagner is truly surprising. You started all this. Now, if only King Galen is as fortunate as his grandson, the time is near for the return of our lord and master, King Galen. Now I finally understand. I see why King Galen gave me this sword. When I met him, I know he asked me, please let me rest. Galen does not wish to repeat his past atrocities. Fate brought me to him, to crush your evil schemes. Nonsense! The king awaits his subjects. No one can stop us. Cornelius, so it is you. Forgive me, I was deceived. We have no time to waste. The Princess of Valentine came looking for you and was captured by the dragon. The dragon is in the sewers. Velvet! All right. I think this is a super. So we can put that. That's probably something else. Puts well, that makes make sense for these things. Anyway, that'll be it for this session because we went on a bit for a bit too long. Take care, everybody, and have a nice day.